It's one of the hottest places on earth and potentially one of the most lucrative. This is Bokh, near Yazd in central Iran. And it's here that iron ore is giving the failing economy a boost. Despite the fact Iran has some of the largest mineral reserves in the world, 57 billion tons, the mining sector is still underdeveloped. But the government and some private companies want to change that with foreign investment. At the moment, uh, the mining industry accounts for about 20 to 25 percent of the stock market. Should investment in the mining industry develop and grow, this should help the stock market in Iran. Especially now as Iran's oil industry is under international sanctions. Exploration projects have grown, especially under outgoing President Mahmoud Ahmadinejad's government, increasing by sixfold. And it's mostly China that's taking advantage. China has good ties with Iran under sanctions, and they're a good backer. China has benefited the most, more so than the European countries. If European countries had the same policy as China, they could benefit too, they could invest. At the moment, Iran doesn't export most of its iron because it doesn't have the refining capacity. Although Iran's economy is based on oil and gas revenue, more people are actually employed in the mining sector, in mines like this one behind me, than in the petrochemical sector. The government puts that figure at close to half a million people. But while this place holds more than dirt, without the means, digging up a profit is still a challenge. Soraya Leni, Al Jazeera, Bof, Central Iran.